Hello, we're going to build a photo sharing app for iPhone and Android in only three minutes. Start with new multi-device application in C++. We'll use the blank template here. Let's resize it a little bit there. And the first thing I want to do is put down a uh, layout that is going to act as my toolbar. It's going to hold my buttons on it. Put that aligned to the bottom. I'm just put a couple buttons down. I'll use a speed button. Uh, just copy and paste that one. And line that one to the left. And then we'll use styles to make these look a little nicer here. Style lookup. This one will be page. And this one will be camera. Now we need to put an image down to store the image that we take in here. And I'm gonna align this one to contents. Contents is different than allow client in that contents goes all the way to the bottom of the form, even though there's toolbars here. One thing though is it's over the form right now, or over the uh, layout right now. So I just gotta go right click on this and say control, send it back. And now I can click on the button here. We'll use actions to access the uh, media library events, and I'm gonna hide that non-visual component. And let's go, we'll start with this one, and we'll go action, new standard action, media library, take photo from camera action. And there's an event, or on the event here, there is a did finish taking. And here I'm gonna say, Image one, bit map, assign, image. So you'll notice the image is passed in here to this event handler, and I'm gonna take that image and store it on the image on the form so that we can uh, preview it. So now for the send button here, we're gonna do a new standard action, media library, show share sheet action. And before execute, we're gonna say, show share sheet action bitmap assign and we're going to assign the image we saved image one bitmap that's it we've wrote all the code we need to write and we can preview this on different devices now so we can say what would this look like on android or we can specifically say, what would this look like on a specific device here with the multi-device preview? Um, just make those a little bigger here so you can see them. So there it is on an iPhone. There it is on a four inch Android. Okay. Um, and we can preview it here as well. If we want to, we can create um, views here specific to different devices. So if we want to tweak it just a little bit on the 5.5 inch iPhone, for example, we can do that. But with that, let's go ahead and deploy this to Android. So I'm just gonna select Android here. It's found my Pixel XL and we hit run without debugging. pixel and we're going to hit the camera button here and there's a tangle of wires behind my desk and there's a little monster that sits down in the corner and keeps an eye out for me. Let's get a picture of him and there we have the picture so now we'll share it and we'll share it on Facebook. There we go. We've shared it on Facebook. So now let's deploy it to Android or iPhone. So I don't have an iPhone, but I do have an iPad. So we're gonna go here, select iPad mini. And again, we'll hit uh, compile and run and we'll deploy it to my iPad. So bring my iPad up so we can view it there. And there it is launched on my iPad. And we'll tap the camera button here. And we'll take a picture of my MacBook. We'll say use photo. 
and we'll hit send button and we'll send this one via Twitter there we go that's all that was required to develop a photo application and install it and run it on both iPhone and Android with C++ Builder.